You told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I. Good morning, everyone. Hi, this is Chrissy with Everyday Tidbits, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If not, welcome back. <laughs> Please hit that subscribe button down below and hit the bell notification so that you're notified every time I post and follow me over there on Instagram at everyday underscore tidbits because I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube and Instagram family. Today, we're going to do a little vlog style type video. I haven't done one of those in a while. I'm going to take you along with me during um, things that I have to do today. I, I don't have an exact plan per se. I do have to run out to my accountant later on and there is a really big Goodwill next door to my accountant's office. So I might stop in there and um, see if they have anything cool because I've been watching a lot of thrift store, uh, thrift thrifters on YouTube. Um, I found Laura Caldwell recently and she does a lot of boho stuff and I really like her style. And of course, Crazy Lamp Lady. I've been loyal to her for almost two years now. So I'm gonna just pop in there real quick. My curiosity has me and see what they have. Uh, it's kind of like right on the street, right down the road from it. But I just wanted to share, you know guys, I love my coffee. Um, and I've been very into the Bones brand, Bones Coffee. I love Bones and I will continue to buy Bones. I'm actually expecting a package Hopefully today, it was supposed to come a couple days ago, but we had some weather and it was delayed. But um, I had dropped my daughter off to this function that she went to the other night and to kill some time, I walked around Target and I found their Target, the, the brand that Target carries, it's Good and & Gather. And they had these coffees on sale, for two for 10. And I was like, all right, well, let me try it. The, the flavor sounded intriguing. So I found this Neapolitan chocolate, vanilla and strawberry. It's really good. Um, and also the Donut Shop Land brand, bleh, Donut Shop Blend. Um, both of them are really, really good. So um, maybe I'll stop at Target as well today, see if they have any other brands. Actually, I'm gonna have so much coffee in my house. So between the shipment from Bones and this, I have, I'm good for now. But they did have lots and lots of flavors. So um, two for $10 for these bags, they were on sale. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. But anyway, um, as you saw from a previous video, I bought a spin bike. I'm loving it so far. I have done a few workouts and um, I found Kaylee Cohen Fitness and Spin Junkie. I'll link their channels below. They're like my two favorite right now as far as workouts. And I just, I'm having a good time with it. Burns a lot of calories, makes me feel better about eating like a gavone lately. I really need to get back onto my 21 day fix um, program because spring's coming and I'm afraid. <laughs> but anyway, um, I'm gonna finish drinking my coffee, clean the table here because we just had groceries delivered and you'll see that grocery haul on Monday and decide what to cook for dinner today. I think I'm going to be making um, pressure luck version of chicken and broccoli in the, in the Instant Pot. So um, if I decide to make that, which I think my daughter actually said that she preferred that over the Irish stew that I'm gonna to make tomorrow night. So I will share that recipe with you as well. But anyway, thanks for joining me today. Let's get the day started. to go work out in my garage on my spin bike and I have my pre-workout so while I'm drinking this and waiting for this to kick in I'm going to show you a few things that I bought from Amazon because the box was just delivered anyway um so 
I bought some basic teas and they were sold in packs of two. The Amazon basic teas are pretty good. They fit really well and they're really soft. So I wound up getting a pink one and uh, like a fuchsia pink as well. And then I got a black one. And they're all v-necks. They need to be ironed. Washed and ironed. And then I got a olive green one. So, Also, I got my daughter and I the same thing. Um, because we've been going to the beach. Like last summer, we went to the beach all summer. And uh, we drove on with our friend. And we went in like, the afternoon and stayed into the evening. And when the sun goes down and you're wet from the beach, it gets a little chilly. So I wound up getting these really light, um, they're like zip up robes and they're really light in material. They have long sleeves and hoodies. So I figured that that would be really comfortable and really light, but also like cover and keep us a little warm in the chilly air at night once the sun goes down on the beach. So these will be washed and folded and then I'll just stick them in our beach bag. So for the summer, they were on sale. That's why I bought them now, cause it's like February and it's cold out. We're supposed to get snow tomorrow, but yeah. So I bought one for myself and one for my daughter. And that's my little Amazon haul for the day. I'm gonna go work out now. <laughs> on my way, I'm pulling up, don't be late. I'm cutting through all the lanes. was a good workout. I burned a lot of calories and I'm really hot. So now I'm just gonna heat up some lunch, get in the shower and go off to run my errands. Whew, load. This is what I am eating for lunch. I'm gonna have some cilantro, lime, rice that's left over from dinner, some black beans. Um, I also put some lime juice and cilantro in there and some celery salt and a piece of steamed halibut. So I'm just gonna eat this real quick and then I'm gonna go jump in the shower. We're in the car. We're heading towards the accountant and Goodwill. My daughter doesn't like to be on film, but she's sitting right beside me. And she's gonna be my little sidekick for our shopping trip today. Our trip to Goodwill was pretty disappointing. There was nothing <laughs> worth buying in there. I did find one candlestick that I really liked and if there was a pair of them, they would have come home with me because they were beautiful. It was They were brass flowers, like, but it was like, not like a tacky brass flower. They were just really pretty. I just, I just wasn't gonna take home one candlestick, but that's pretty much it. That's all I found and it was crowded. I don't know if there was just nothing because it was already picked over because we got here. It's like three o'clock in the afternoon and really I understand that if you want to go to Goodwill and get good stuff, you probably have to come when they first open. But this was like really disappointing. So my daughter and I are going to go get some boba tea now. I got a tiramisu with tapioca pearls and almond milk. And my daughter got lychee green tea with lychee pearls. It looks really good. Cheers. That mannequin is scary. Oh my God. We just got home from running our errands and uh, realized I forgot to stop at the farm, at the uh, church to pick up the confirmation packet. And I'm exhausted and I don't feel like going back out, so I'm just gonna have to do that tomorrow. But anyway, um, we stopped at the liquor store and I picked up my favorite inexpensive bottle of wine. I actually got two of them. 
So we got that and I picked up a porter beer for my Irish stew that I'm going to be making tomorrow. It's supposed to snow tomorrow. It's supposed to get three to five inches. And I feel like it's the perfect day to simmer a pot of Irish stew. So I'll be making that. And then my coffee came, the coffee I was talking about this morning. And, oh, okay, there's coffee in the box. Um, all right, Bones Coffee, caramel, salted caramel. My favorite Bones Coffee is actually the Wonder Bones. It's like the, they had it for Oktoberfest. It's like a pretzel, like the German pretzel. And it's discontinued. But it was weird because like at first I didn't like it because of the salty like aftertaste, but I wound up really liking it. So I figured I would try the salted caramel and hopefully, hopefully I like this one. And then I got caramel apple, which is my daughter's favorite. She really likes this one. So I got that and I got two of those because they were actually on sale. The caramel apple was on clearance because they're about to discontinue this one too because it was a fall flavor. And then, this one was on sale as well, um, the eggnog flavor. And we got a Bones mystery flavor. It doesn't say what it is, so I don't know. Um, eggnog, salted caramel, caramel apple. Yeah, I, I guess we'll find out when I brew it, but that's what we got. Now I'm going to just... Um, Probably get ready to cook dinner. I'm gonna be making chicken and broccoli in the Instant Pot and it's from Pressure Luck and I will link that recipe below. But I am running out of steam, <laughs> I'm exhausted, I'm so tired. Part of me just wants to like relax and just wing it for dinner, but I don't know. Cause I've been thinking about you. chicken and broccoli came out really good. I liked it, my daughter, not so much. I'm not really sure why. I mean, it does taste a little different than what we would get in the store, but she normally orders sesame chicken and not chicken and broccoli. But I think it tastes, tastes good, definitely tastes good. Um, so I didn't get to everything on my list today. I, I'm saving the laundry for tomorrow because I'm running out of steam. <laughs> And I just want to like clean up the kitchen and relax for the rest of the night. Also, I didn't get to the church because I forgot. So hopefully um, I can get to there tomorrow or Friday. We're supposed to get snow tonight. So I might not get there tomorrow. But if not, I will get there on Friday. So I just wanted to thank you all so much for joining me today. Because I really appreciate your support. Make sure you hit that. <coughs> Miss Goose. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And hit the bell notification so that you're notified every time I post. Follow me over there on Instagram at everyday underscore tippets because I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube and Instagram family. Hope everyone's being safe. Thank you again, and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. Amazing.